Hey everybody, it's Joe from GreenLightSound.com, and today we're going to take a look at a new plugin from Waves, the CLA NX, the latest in the NX series of headphone plugins that are meant to model real acoustic spaces, real pro studios. We've got an Abbey Road Studio 3 version of this, an Ocean Way Nashville version, the original NX itself, and now we've got this CLA NX, which is based upon Chris Lord Algae's Mix LA Studio, designed by acoustician and designer Vincent Van Hoff, a great sounding space now available in your headphones. It shares many of the same controls as the other NX plugins, so we'll go over them really quickly. First of all, you can do head modeling, a custom head profile, so the psychoacoustic effect fits your specific physical characteristics. We've got headphone EQ and a drop down list here. A handful of headphones to choose from, but I tend to use this with Sonoworks instead. That's a great solution. Sonoworks works for a lot more headphone models than this one does. Of course, you could use no headphone correction at all. We've got head tracking. You can buy a Bluetooth head tracker from Waves, or you can just use your computer's camera. And that allows you to turn your head around the studio and kind of have the sound feel like you're turning your head. So if you turn your head to the left, you're going to get more sound into that right ear and vice versa. You can also rotate the studio manually here with this center dial. Take a look behind the studio at all of Chris Lord Algae's fabulous outboard gear or center it back onto the SSL console. We've got a level knob and right next to that, an ambience knob. At 100%, it's default setting. That is the actual captured impulse response of this space, what it really sounds like according to the waves capture. We can boost it up to get more room sound or pull it back to get less. But I usually would just leave it at 100% for that idealized room sound, what it really sounds like in the room. Included with CLA NX are three sets of monitors. You've got the near fields, which are CLA 10s plus a subwoofer. The CLA 10 is an NS10 from Yamaha, a customized version of it, Chris Lord Algae branded. The mains are custom Oceanway HR1s right up here. Then we've got a boom box we can select, which is actually rack mounted on the outboard gear we saw behind us. So if you leave yourself in this direction, looking at the console straight ahead, it'll sound like the sound of the boom box is coming from behind you, or you can hit this little button here and flip around so that the boom box seems like it's straight on. And that's a really good way to check mixes on kind of a junky speaker. You mix on your near fields, you check for punch on the mains, and then you go to the boom box to see what it sounds like on a lot of normal playback systems. And that's basically it for the controls. So let's hear this thing. Let's see what it sounds like. We're gonna go through some of the different features of it. So the first thing I'm gonna do is suggest you put on a pair of headphones. This is meant for headphones. So pop them in now if you've got them so you can hear what the really effect is doing. On speakers, it won't really be as noticeable. First thing I'm gonna play is just the bypassed plugin, the straight up mix without this room on it. Now I'm going to engage the room. We've got our near fields, the CLA 10s plus subwoofer. I'm going to move over to the main monitors. Right up here. Remember, these are the ocean ways. definitely hear that bigger room sound. It's a bigger speaker, a lot more bass response there. Here's the boom box. I'll start with it in this orientation and then hit this button halfway through to flip back so it's straight on. Next thing I'll do is just kind of cycle through all of them as the mix plays to give you a sense of how they all sound different from one another.
Next thing I'll do is I'll move this rotate studio dial so you can kind of hear how the orientation changes when you would move your head. We just hit that zero to go back to center. Now I'll move the ambience knob left and right. Left reduces it, right increases it to see how it has effect on the near field monitors. I think it sounds best straight up in its default setting. So there we have it, CLA NX, the newest in the NX series of plugins from Waves. I use some other headphone correction systems when I'm mixing on headphones. This one is the most natural sounding one from Waves so far to me, the closest to that one that I use. So great job, Waves, highly recommended. The CLA NX plugin, a chance to mix in CLA's room over headphones with this modeling plugin from Waves. If you have any questions or comments, let me know in the comment section down below. Don't forget to subscribe if you haven't done so already, so we can keep you in the loop as to what's coming up next, and I'll see you in the next one.